Eight, we're rolling. All right, Stonehenge, Barn Hashnikovsky, five out of 30, uh, 30 poems in 30 days. I'm a day or so behind, I'm gonna catch up hopefully. Um, but here is day five. Okay, on TV, RuPaul, Rand Paul, and a lot of shit I don't care about. A world that got way too small for all these beers on the wall and I need distribution for these new line cinematic ideas to make paramount. My own dirty laundry, I air it out. No whereabouts. The stakes are high, and I'm from the soul since potholes in my lawn. Prince Paul, Goldie Locks, and three bears in a house. Tree snares and an open blouse. Day five, it's a poetry challenge, and this is a lesson of how to stay alive. First rule, don't die. And if you do, return from the realm of Hades like the hell spawn mixed with Genghis Khan and the Lord of the Flies. Second rule, don't kill people. Be peaceful. That seems obvious, but most are oblivious to the way that death demand is supplied and we tend to provide volunteers. All are welcome to face the evil. Don't wait for the sequel. Rather, blade to the neck of Satan. I rage while appreciating the blessings, the common sense reflection, the eternal influence of respiration. No diplomacy in these last days. You're either with me or against me in this fight for freedom and righteousness. No halfway. No one foot in, one foot out. This is set sail, burn the oars. No going back to shore. We either drown with the ship or we make it to the destination. Every soldier willing to give his or her soul. No consideration of reparations. We might not make it. Everything on the table. You think it's simply metaphor and simile, but it's literal, visceral, vocal volatility, value and variance, variant. Virtual velocity, cyclical total mystery. Yeah, my joy and merriment with mendicants. It's my existence of critical hopeful intensity. Paranoid in the world of clairvoyance and me trying to take the pain and bury it. No, hold the pain and carry it. Brandish it. <laughs> I think I want to free the slaves like Harry, but it's more like the fantastic world of Walter Mitty. Morbid and miserable. Black out lost memory. Smash mouth, no penalty. I rap about being stressed out and depressed clinically. Compulsively, obsessively, and telling the psychiatrist, you know what? You don't know shit about me. How's that for my psychotherapy and mentality? Maslow's hierarchy and needs, Carl Jung collective unconscious, behavioral and cognitive sciences to explain why I seek the truth and clarity. Maybe I'm projecting. Well, what were you expecting? More psychological assessments and testing? More trauma and baggage collecting? Nah, just a monster that's resting, about to wreck your nesting. Now back to current events. Parn Hash coming through a cash drought, but still investing in his own etchings in the West Wing, wasted with his best friends, accepting the blessings? Don't insult my craft. This is PhD level for freshman crash, chorus and force times mass. No remorse but blind wrath. Sea level expression, free rebel horse and hot grass. Getting burned like my pile to cash for this culture clash. These words of truth and freedom are all that I have. Please respect it. All right? Peace. See you in the next one.